Guys, if you want cheap and reliable NBA 2K20 MT, go to Safe NBA MT for fast delivery and use code WITNESS for a 5% discount. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. If you need to go 12 or no, complete spotlight challenges or spotlight sim challenges, domination, evolve cards, and more things like that, Go ahead and contact Rose NBA on Twitter right now. Link for that is in the description. Yo, what's good, guys? Winners 2K back on NBA 2K20. In this video, we have a prize pack pack opening video where I'm going to be opening up all these unopened packs I have. I've gotten a few. There's been a lot of limited locker codes that we got from creators over the weekend. So I've collected up some of them. We got just a bunch of packs. We have. 28 so we have nearly 30 packs i'm going to go ahead and open it so make sure you guys go ahead drop a like right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new with that notification bell turned on we do have some legacy packs but that pack right there is actually really good we got two current silver players which might actually sell for a decent amount i need i do need the mt at the moment i am kind of broke i'm not gonna lie to you but um you know i'm happy with silver players honestly because they can sell for a few thousand sometimes, flip all. What do we got here? All right, we'll take a free Amethyst. I'm assuming it's gonna be the Legacy player. I have no idea who this could be. It is a shooting guard from the Rocket. It's not Harden, is it? It's just gonna be the standard James Harden. No idea what his value is, but we'll take it for now. He may have some value, who knows? We'll take it. Um, but those Legacy packs, I don't expect anything too crazy from them. I got another one here. George Mikan, he was a, uh, is he? He's a diamond, right? Pretty sure. I can't really remember, to be honest. Doesn't matter. We're going to get a ruby, but we do get... We get a Muggsy Bogues, but we do get another silver card. I'll be sending all those to the auction to sell. Make as much MT as I can from this prize pack pack opening. Still got things to sell from when I opened up those super packs, which completely robbed me of my money. But I do have a couple of pink diamonds I can open some diamonds, I got stacks of contracts, you know, a bunch of stuff I do need to sell. I should be able to make probably, I don't know, a, a, few, a few thousand, a few, a few, maybe over a hundred thousand after I sell everything, after I pull everything from here. And we do have some of those Showtimes packs, which could potentially have Goat uh, Magic Johnson, which would be nice to pull, but obviously I'm asking for a lot then, but I mean, you know, you got you got to dream big. You gotta dream big right now. Uh, let's open up these league packs. I wish these were the series two ones, and I wish you could pull. What do you call them? Those throwback, the throwback moments ones. But I honestly don't think you can. I remember in 2K19, whenever you would land um, like moments packs, the moments players, but no one ever pulled moments cards from them. So I don't actually think that they're in series. If you get a prize pack series two, I don't think you can actually pull the throwback moments from them. We get a Sapphire Demar Derozan right here. But I mean, we're pulling the pulling cards like this, like those day one type cards. We're gonna be back to that soon in a couple of months. Like it's nearly, nearly time for 2K21, which I don't know how how this how it's gonna work. Like, is the NBA season even gonna be over yet? Like, who knows what's gonna happen with the season? Obviously, because of coronavirus and everything like that. But um, who knows what's gonna happen with that? It's gonna be weird. It's gonna be it's. I mean, the only good thing about it, I guess, it's going to be something completely different than what we're used to. You know, like 2K, every time they drop a new 2K, it is different, but you know, it's the same basic concept. I still enjoy it, but it's still pretty much the same basic concept. So maybe if we could take something positive out of it, you know, we, we could get something just different that would be fun for us. We, we may enjoy it more than normal. We may enjoy 2K more than normal, and I cannot wait to play 2K on the next gen consoles. I cannot wait to get a PS5 and start playing that. Got another, got a standard league pack. I don't even know where the hell I got this pack. Was that, on, that actually might've been on one of the lower end boards. We get a silver play. We've, we've pulled a good amount of silver cards. We could make probably 10, 10 plus K just from the silver players we've pulled. Um, we got super packs as well. Legacy super packs, which have like pink diamond, Nate Derman and stuff like that. Can we get a Mark Price? No, we get a we get a Kyle Kuzma. Let's open up. We'll open up this lights out packs, then we'll try those super packs out. Those legacy super packs. We do get an amethyst. Is it going to be Ray or Gil? It's going to be Ray Allen, I believe. 
All right, we'll take a quick Ray Ray. I think he sells for like 2K. I honestly don't even think he's worth sending to the auction, but I'll send him to the auction anyway and see what we can get for him. So he's a solid card, but there's no, there's no real point in the Amethyst when you can just spend probably the same amount of MT and just pick up the, just pick up the diamond one, the diamond, is that a VIP Prime? I don't know where that, that diamond one came from, to be honest. These packs right here, these Spotlight Isaiah Thomas ones, have actually been kind of juiced for me. I've pulled two pink diamonds from these three packs before. So not, if we could do that again, it'd be nice. But those Showtime, even the new fan favorites, I mean, like if you were able to pull a JR Smith, He's got a new EVO requirement. I, apparently, it makes him really good. All right, we got Campus Legend as well. We got Fan Faves. Let's open up the Super Packs. Then we'll open up the Wild Packs. Packs I think 2K should add is, they should, we got an Amethyst right here. They should add the Prime Series Tim Duncan Packs to the Triple Threat Boards because that card is super expensive, that Pink Diamond Timmy D. I don't know if his value's gone down ever since the Opal was released, but the value, the, the, the I remember that Pink Diamond Tim Duncan was so expensive. I don't know if people would just buy him for the Opal Ray Allen. I'm not too sure, but he was so expensive. I don't know what his value is doing at the moment. But yeah, I got two of those Showtime packs, packs which imagine pulling a Magic or, or a Rashad Lewis or something out of that. That'd be ridiculous. We pull a Ruby Nick Anderson right there. Nothing too special about that. How many more Super Packs we got? Two more Super Packs. I've been getting some pretty nice boards lately as well, not gonna lie. I always go for packs over everything. Another Ruby, Isaiah Ryder, we pull him every time. Isaiah Ryder, I saw, I was playing when I was grinding for those, um, the goat bird. I was playing those online challenges and we versed, we came up against an Isaiah Ryder. And bro, that man looks like a miniature shack in his 2K character. It looks so funny because he's obviously a lot smaller than Shaq. It looks like a miniature Shaq. It's freaking hilarious. I couldn't, when I saw him, I was like, is that Shaq? But like glitched, he even was wearing number 34 as well. So that was pretty funny. But if we could pull a pink diamond Wilts, who doesn't sell for much, but it'd still be nice to get him. We got to get at least a pink diamond pull, but I mean, we haven't pulled pink diamonds from these packs. So hopefully the good pulls are waiting for us when we open up those Showtime fan favorites, Campus Legends. Hopefully that's where the good pulls are waiting for us, but bro, I don't know. I don't know, we could, we could, we could open up some Super Packs. It's a possibility because you can pull Goat, MJ, and Magic. We got another Silver player. You can pull Goat, MJ, and stuff like that from those Super Packs, so. I don't know if it's worth opening up a couple of singles, getting some VC and opening up a couple of singles. Let's open up the rest of these and see what we get. If I'm not satisfied, we may have to dip our toes in a little bit of VC. Ooh, these are not deluxe at all. Fan favorites, not showing us love. Let's try Campus Legend. You know I gotta save those showtimes till last. They gotta wait. Ooh, we do get an Amethyst. So this is gonna be Eric or uh, Okafor, right? Yeah, that's who he's going to be. We'll take him. He may have some value. I mean, I don't know why anyone will lock in that set for Carl Anthony Towns when you can pick up cards like Chris Despazingas just off the auction for pretty cheap. Even Pascal Siakam's a buy it now at the moment. Four more packs. We'll open up. We'll go one for one. We'll go fan faves, showtime, fan faves, showtime. Can we get a free Galaxy Opal? No. This is going to be... Oh, God. Oh, God. That is quick sell stuff right there. Come on, if I can get an Opal Rashad Lewis or a Magic Johnson, that'd be the biggest dub ever. We do get, oh yeah, of course we're gonna get a diamond. These are guaranteed either diamonds, are they? Diamond or better, that's all you can get from these. It's gonna be a Muggsy Bogues, it's so tiny. I think they're making a triple threat trio with like Muggsy Bogues and like Nate Robinson and Earl Boinkings or something like that. Just the smallest trio I could possibly make. He's a duplicate, of course. Actually, I think I should just should have just quick sold that. Diamonds are so cheap from that set. Last fan favorites pack though. Come on, give me an opal. Imagine, oh, that's terrible, that's terrible. We get a bronze card right there, do we have him? That can get quick, quick sold. Final pack of the prize pack, if it's not an opal, then I think we've got to try out some of those super packs and see if we can get lucky. Come on, 
something. Oh god. Oh god, these price packs were not juiced for us. So we got some VC right here and we have these packs to open. I don't really want to open a 20 box, honestly. I kind of just want to open up a couple of singles until we see like an opal or something like that. I'm not even going to bother showing you guys this animation. So you see right here, JR's got an opal. Like, there's meant to be freaking... I'm so confused right now because... There we go. So Goat MJ is showing in there. Is magic in here? There's Shaq still in here. Like, I'm so confused. Like, these are, like, different for everybody. It's so weird. Like, I'm pretty sure... There is Giannis. I'm pretty sure T-Mac is meant to be in here. Because T-Mac has an Evo requirement. Why would he not be in these new packs? It's so confusing. I don't know why it's doing that. But, um... Because when, when I originally first opened packs... Oh, my God. Where are the Opals at? When I first opened packs... Goat MJ wasn't showing in them. Even Goat Magic is meant to be in these, but for some reason he's just not showing up for me. Um, let's try a couple of these. I don't really want to call it quits, but I think we might. Let's go! Let's freaking go! That's what I want to see. Finally, we pulled an opal, guys. Finally. This I think this can be, I might open one more pack after this, and then that's it. But make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like right now. And subscribe to the channel if you're new. Please give me LeBron James. That's all I want. Give me LeBron. It ain't LeBron. Kevin Durant? If that's KD, that's that's decent. I don't know when I'm posting this video. But we could already possibly see a glitched KD. I literally just put my Kevin Durant on the auction house. So I don't know if a glitched KD has been released yet. Because this is was recorded in the past but that i'm gonna sell him asap but that's actually a really good pull right there can we go back to back back to back opal pulls would be amazing 2k kind of owes us no it's not but i'm not gonna i'm gonna leave it at that we opened up a couple of singles we got a galaxy opal pull and it was actually a really good one durant has lost some value because of rumors that he's getting a glitch card but he still sells for like 300k he's still selling for actually like nearly 400k which is actually pretty good i hope so I, I should have two kds to sell on the auction so you see right here i literally just put my kevin durant on the auction house and now we're going to do the same to this one right here if we can sell both of these and then they drop a glitch one which destroys value with this one that is going to be a massive dub to sell two opal kevin durant's get some good value for it and hopefully we pick up a glitch KD that can like play shooting guard even though I'll probably still run him at small forward. But that is going to wrap up this pack opening video guys. Finally got an opal pull at the end there and we didn't have to spend too much VC and it was actually a really solid pull as well. I'm happy with that. I hope you guys all did enjoy this prize pack pack opening video. Make sure you do drop a like right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new and I'll catch you on the next upload. It's been witnessed. Oh,